Hello, my fans, friends, followers. Yes, I am talking to you once and for all. Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas to you all. As I zoom in through my park here, I shall introduce myself. I am D-Man RoboDad. There I am temporarily for the season. Got a little toy bag, Santa hat, reindeer glasses. I am still D-Man RoboDad. Before I introduce my park, I'd like to introduce those who helped me. Thank you all very much. Even though some may not know how big the impact. Thank you very much. Magic Dark World. Foxia94. Tootie, Fruity Dude. Clazy. Nerdy Yoda Girl. More to come. Thanks. Is your name not listed? Please let me know. Remind me what you've done. All my fans, yes, you too. Thank you very much for following. If you haven't seen you in time, Merry Christmas, belated or not. Merry Christmas to you all. I'm on YouTube, of course. Here I am. I'm going to tour my park. I'm going to show you a little bit on the outside village. There's the train station to the left. The Polar Express. We will ride that in the next video. First, I'm going to show you the Rocking Schoolhouse disc. Just going to go inside real quick. Or not. Or so. I guess I can't make up my mind. Just a simple static ride covered by a building. Kind of what I call working farm. You'll see a lot of these rides inside buildings. Let's come back downstairs. Love the scenery. Like my new lights. Just got that done this season. Park was built two years ago. Couldn't get it done in time. Had some other issues. But I'm back. Entering the Red Barn Enterprise. Coming down the street, my friend Foxy helped me build the street. Thank you, Foxy. He gave me the idea. Space rings. You see a couple of these houses with space rings. Just look for a space filler. Tea time? Who said tea time? Oh, look. It's a teacup ride. That's fitting. Here's just lemonade, but if you've never tried an Arnold Palmer, you are missing out. Lemonade and tea, 50 50. Oh, it is so good. Outhouse? We don't need that. He's an ice cream and coffee shop. Oh, cold and hot treat store. What I can do for some good ice cream and yogurt right now. a dark space. If there's ever a village with a dark alley, this is it. And yes, they are very dirty. Coming up to the man brick mansion plane ride. It's just got my figure out what else to cover the planes with. Why I put it in a brick mansion? I have no idea. Coming back in down into that dark alley, I think we are going to see one more house with space rings. Hop over this railing. Here we are. Can't find my way out. Oh, wait, there it is. Nope, back to the entrance, out the exit. Let's do it proper, right? Can't tour a village if I don't do it properly. The reindeer stables, but that's the exit. Back to that dark alley for the entrance. Yep, 
Okay, there's Ranger in the walls there. There's Rudolph. Let's get it back to the bar. Cafe. There's the outhouse. We don't need the outhouse. I'm in the middle of the bar, so I'm going to exit. I'm going to go around to the front so I can show you the whole thing. Couldn't make up my mind. Yes, this is being recorded audio-wise after the fact of play. If you've ever been to a pub, they have eateries. You can get chicken and wings and all kinds of goodies, and that's what I put here. Snacks and sides. Now, if you're not 21, you don't understand these drinks. I don't want to know if you do. Martinis and margaritas. Oh, I must have hit the picture. The image outside. There we go. So I was just showing you their drinks and slushy stalls, but I named them differently. Just for the uh, feel of the pub. And then you got your brews and ales, different beers. Again, you should be 21 before you know that. Exiting the pub from the balcony. Back down the little side step. That's the Mountainside Pub. Back on the main street. We're going to go back down here to the courthouse. The Honorable, which is just a Gravitron. Down underneath, we go to this cafe. My friend Magic built most of this. Magic Dark World at the time, now known as Magic Wildflower. She built most of this. I think I added the steam for the fire grill effect. For the mountainside burgers. Passing back over the train station. Once again, we'll catch that next video. Today we are just touring the park on foot. Bet you all can't wait to see the inside of that winter wonderland. Oh look, we got Frost Mountain Observatory. Probably should correct that. Oh, I am too. I'm a slow typer. Frost Mountain Observatory. That one's messed up too, huh? That stupid filter. Let's get that one fixed as well, huh? Frost Mountain Observed. Popping open a can of soda here. Don't mind the uh, loud crack. Oh! That didn't blow your ears off, I hope. Oh, I had to go back just so I could show you. I was supposed to cut that out, but oh well. So we've got the observatory that climbs the mountain and sees it on the outside. Climbing the hill on the other side of the mountain. More to come through there. Guess I can't show you that right now. It's not complete. Work in progress. Just adding stuff to the expansion that they gave us with more space. Crossing the bridge down below. This would be the uh, Grinch who stole Christmas. Here we got the pizza box. Wasn't sure what to put here. I was like, hey, I'm going to use the pizza store. How do you make pizza on a Christmas theme park, right? Well, there it is. The pizza box. You gotta have your refreshments for pizza, right? Here we have the Grinch Shipwreck. And beyond it is the Grinch's Stole Christmas Ride. I'm not showing you at the moment. 
that will be written in a few videos shown anyway. I'll write it anytime I want. This is my part. <laughs> you think I'm going in the right, but I'm not. And there's the exit. Let's pretend I just got off the ride and we continue. <laughs> For those who know me, that's one of my favorite rides, Magic Dark World, it's her favorite ride, she's spoken very clearly about that, she loves that ride. I don't know why, it's like an evil side to Christmas, why would you want the evil side, but hey, it's a fun ride. It's only for entertainment, all this is entertainment. Here we got the fireball. Fireball grains, I called it. I'm in a grain wheat field, and this is a, a grain plant, a process plant for wheat. Here we got Santa's sweet shop. Gifts, souvenirs. You can buy a little Santa gifts. You got berry, blueberry, crushing cherry, super strawberry, caramel crunch, chocolate chunk. We also got Pink Paradise and Blueberry Blast. All oh, those are frosty drinks. Santa's Sweet Shop. I got the idea from Nerdy Yoda Girl that said on the sign, but it didn't clearly show it. I built a Santa hat to go on the ride to the restaurants. Now here we are in winter, entering Winter Wonderland. Or you thought. <laughs> I'll show you that next video. Stick around. Next time I post a video, we'll hopefully show you the inside of Winter Wonderland. Excuse me. In fact, I did mention my next video will be the Polar Express, and that will be the introduction to Winter Wonderland. You will see me ride the train, and how wild the train gets, just like the movies. And I enter through a magical experience, and I come out in the Winter Wonderland. But, as you can see, you can also enter Wonderland... If you ever visit my park, you can always go by foot, but I suggest the Polar Express. So I'm heading out of town. I forgot two other stops. I'm going to see the share station slide. Just a little kid slide here. Go in, come down, go right back in. Someone should clean it up. Not me. <laughs> next we got the jailbreak drop. What better building next to a sheriff than a jailhouse? Oh yeah. Put a jailbreak drop in there. It's pretty cool. I went up a couple times. You can see outside through the uh, jail bar wall. It's a cool ride. But I guess I don't show it. Well that's it for today. As we exit... I thank you all for watching. Merry Christmas once again. I hope you catch me for the next ones. I have a tight schedule with work, but I'll do my best to get this released. Much appreciation. Thanks to many of you for helping me out. Including those names I mentioned. Thanks again. <laughs>